Hey guys, and welcome back. Today, we're gonna do something special for Father's Day. We're gonna burn stuff. I don't know, it's always been something with burning stuff since I was a kid, but I like it. And today we've got the perfect conditions. We got some tropical weather coming in off the Gulf, bringing in a, a good steady breeze for us to provide some oxygen and airflow to the fire. I got some good dry brush back here behind me. We got some diesel to throw on it. I'm just gonna see how big I can get this thing. Let's go get it. Oh, and by the way, happy Father's Day to all you dads out there. This, this fire is for y'all. All right, guys, we got us some diesel in the bucket there. A bucket in the bucket. And we're gonna eat out here and dump it on the fire or on the pile, and jump out and get this thing started. This, uh, this brush is really dense. So I think I'm gonna have to start it very small and get it real hot and then build it up from there. And I'm gonna see how high I can stack this thing so we can maximize our burning and uh, we're gonna spend the next couple of days, you can see out here what we're working on. We're gonna spend the next couple of days while we have some less than ideal weather. Uh, we're gonna try to spend it out here burning. Look at that. Perfect. All right, let's get back in and feed it. See, I was saying this stuff's really dense. It's not a whole lot of big debris in it, a whole lot of big brush or trees in it. So I gotta be real careful. I don't wanna choke it out. And you can see right there that, uh. That small stuff will burn up pretty quick. So if I go too big, too tall with our pile, too fast and don't get enough hot coals under it, I think I'll just kind of smother it out and I don't want to do that. But I also don't want it to just burn up all my diesel. So we're going we're gonna to work it and see what happens. That almost fell back on me. Try to get some of this bigger stuff on there too while it's burning good. Try to start getting some of that hot. That's what's gonna sustain our fire. The rest of that's just gonna burn up like kindling.
All right, looks like we've burned down quite a bit. And I'm starting to see some, some white stuff in there, some coal starting to develop. So I need to stoke it and keep it burning and getting hotter and get that to burn down some more. So what I like to do is just like stoking a, a fire in a fire pit or something, you kind of poke around at your coals. So what I like to do is find a, the biggest couple of logs that I can, which is gonna be these pieces of pine right here. And all I do is just kind of rotate them, change, watch that, watch it in the middle, how it'll kick up all that stuff. And see, when I push them around and change their position, you see all that stuff kick up? So it's doing that on the inside of the fire. And whenever that, that stuff kind of twists in there, it'll knock all those coals loose. And it's doing the same thing as stoking it with like a fire poker or something. And at the same time, by repositioning it, it helps generate a little more airflow and really gets that stuff to cooking. You can really see I got good airflow by the speed of the smoke coming out of there, which is exactly what we want. There's another log right there and we'll try to pick it up. I don't know how long it is. Pick it up, kind of move it around. Look at that. Look at all that stuff kicking up out the middle. That's exactly what I want to happen. go get some plan B. See what I can do. Might all be gone.
get down there and do a little selfie in front of it uh, for the thumbnail for the video. Man, I had I had hot abs on the side of my face. And it only it ain't gonna show up as full in the video. I already checked, but man, it was, it was pretty aggressive there for a second. It's just it's just too much light brush, old dead leaves and stuff. And man, it's going everywhere. And uh, it don't have a whole lot of big flames to show it. But that sucker's hot, so I'm gonna let it burn down there for a minute. Get you right back there. I'm gonna let it burn down for a second and uh, pull some of this wet stuff on out of here and let it dry out so uh, it can dry out overnight. And we'll get back in here in the morning and burn it down some more. But that's about as big as I can get it safely. So happy Father's Day, guys. That was for y'all. She's hot now, boys. Woo, burning my face. Good.